Hello, 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 and welcome back, everybody. We are doing another episode of Insane Graft in our slightly bigger base now, which is fantastic that we actually have space to work in. Um, I can't be happier, actually. Oh, we're having a little bit of lag because I've just launched the world. Because I'm trying, I try not to waste too much time. Um, today, <laughs> one, I really want to try. Uh, well, I wanted to try that for one. Uh, I really want to try and make this a 20 minute episode. I've tried so hard the last couple to do just 20 minutes and it's impossible. I can't do it. <laughs> I keep going to like 40 minutes. So we're going to try and stay in here and work on some mods a little bit. I think we need to look into some sort of generator um, to be able to sort of progress into some real stuff. So, let's just have a quick think about what's like relatively useful for us right now. What does this one do? Dragon Breath, cool. You're not useful. Frosty Generator. Okay. Snow. Right. Uh, heated Redstone. So you put Lava and Redstone in there. Death Generator. Ooh. We could we could we could mess around with a death generator. That's not a not a bad one for us. Uh overclock generator? Just anything? Any carpets? Weird. Um The pink generator, I think it's fairly obvious that it just melts pink things. Uh slimy. Uh, no. Explosive, I think, yet yeah, no. Survival is just anything that burns, I guess. Potions, nether star, furnace. Magmatic is just lava. I think this is also a good one for us. Um, we do need some sort of cables as well. Cable. Cable. I don't know why I kept struggling there. Um, something that will transfer power. Energy cable, that's a, a solid choice. Uh, is that the only type of cables that we've got for energy? Okay, cool, yo. Uh, what about a battery? Block of some form. Cyclic to a battery as well, that looks fairly reasonable to make. Is that a redstone block? That is. So we could do that. This might not be the worst. Okay, we also could do with trying to find this lava that drove me a little insane last time. Because um, <laughs> if we are going to do the magmatic one, the lava would be useful. <laughs> but I don't know where it is. Like, if we look at the map, right, uh, J, right, yeah. <laughs> it's here. This is lava, right? Vertical chunks. Oh wait, we want to go down. Is it above us? Like, so much of me thinks it's above us. This is the wrong thing. Let's just... Ooh. <laughs> I so think it must be above. Ooh. God damn. We're just throwing ourselves down the same hole. Right. Let's just try mine up again. And let's see if the noise goes away when we go up. Oh, it's above us. Okay. Okay, let's just be very reasonable about this. It's here. Okay, right, this is perfect. We have a big source of lava here. Let's just open this up a little bit so we can have a look. Yeah, okay, perfect, right. So we can run a magmatic generator using this for a while. So that's fine. We just need to dig our way back down now. 
which is no problem for me. Uh, bam. Down we go. Uh, down here. Okay, so we found it, though. We weren't super crazy. We were a little crazy. Uh, we did lose our mind ever so slightly. But we found it, so that's fine. Um, in which case, the magmatic generator is the best choice for us to be able to start progressing with power. So, let's start making some things. Uh, so first off, I did see one of the things. So this requires just glass, clay, and redstone block. That's fine. So we've got clay. Um, we have enough redstone to make at least one battery, because I think it's important. Um, we will need more glass, I think, which needs more sand. Let's get eight sand. Five, six, seven, eight. And let's get that cooked up real quick. Um, right, eight sand. Give me a coal. Give me a coal, damn it. One coal, that's all we need. Uh, chuck that in there. Right, that's going to make some glass for us. So that will be the battery done. Cables require stone bricks as well, so we actually need to make, oh wait, no, we just cook them as is, don't we? So, in that case, so that we're not wasting coal, let's grab a bucket, well, we could take it out here, actually, it's not going to change our life that much, uh, put this in here, put this in here, get some bricks cooked up, so that will be these two bits done. Now the magmatic generator requires a furnace generator, some gold and redstone. Furnace generator requires a machine block and a furnace and just some iron and redstone. So the machine block is iron redstone. It's not too expensive. Um, let's try and make two if we can. Um, I think we're going to need wood. I think that's what's stopping us right now. So let's go up, up, up and get some wood. Once we've got some power sorted, we can move back to doing some more blood magic, uh, now that we've also got a better source of food. But of course the power will help us get better food as well, because we'll be able to um, build a farm properly, and harvest potatoes at a reasonable rate. I hear someone coming for me. Haha, <laughs> sucker! Get back here. Die. Die. Yeah, dead. Oh, these guys give me the circle plague or whatever that is. No circle plague for me, sir. Uh, and then back down we go. <gasps> Creeper, he's looking at our farm. What? Why? Okay. Protect the farm at all costs. My God, he just he just detonated himself for no reason. That was a uh, that was crazy, right? <laughs> That was crazy. Uh, cool, there's our battery done. We can do that for now. Um, so, if we want this, we need two chests. And that's fine. One, two. Uh, we need some iron. Uh, eek, eek. We're probably going to need more iron. Uh, I'm just looking, do we have any more iron? We, we had some more, right? Um... Oh, well, there's that, at least. I thought we had uh, found some ore. That's fine. Um, so, we want two of you... Oh, this makes four. Nuts, okay. Um, so then, to make this, we need the furnace generator. I just wanted to make sure. So we want two furnaces. That's fine. Oh, perfect amount of cobble for that. So, two furnace generators, which then become two of you. We just need buckets of lava, which we have a bucket here. I think we need more gold though, right? Yeah, we probably do need more gold. That's fine. We do that. Bang. Done. Then we come down here. Have a tool, beast. Die. Ha-ha. On guard, my friend. Bye. Why? Goddamn, sons. What are you doing in here? Where's the zombie I hear? 
Okay. Let's just be very aware that they're coming for me. And I don't know where from. We've opened up some sort of hell portal by digging down, I think. Hello? Where are you? Scum? Villain? Where are you? Show yourself. Uh, that's fine. Uh, so we can now make one of you. Is it going to use the bucket? It didn't use the bucket. So technically, again, I don't know why we went all that way. We can steal from the smeltery just to make our second one. Bam. Then we need our bricks to make some bricks to make some stairs. I think we're missing bricks, though, yeah. We need two more bricks. This is a little bit slow. That's fine. Um, but for now, then, we've got our magmatic... It would be nice if maybe we managed to dig over to here from upstairs. Where is this right now? Uh, 865 878. 865 878. Right, let's see about that. 865 878. And it's 62. Ugh. 865878. Are we on 62? This is 62 here, so we should just be able to go, I think, this way. 865878. 865878. 865878 is what we're looking for. Hello! Mr. Zombie in the wall, die. Uh, right, eight, seven, eight, perfect. This is probably a more reasonable path over here than what we were previously doing, which is climbing up those stairs. Um, and now we have easy access to the lava. Because we just come through here. We can carve this open a little bit more. Yay! Look at that tunnel. We just ah, we just come down here, and then we can even break this open just a little bit more, just for the sake of space and stuff. Is this marble? And a site. Um, lovely. Okay, cool. And we're out. Right, so that now means that we don't have to faff around a huge amount. Um, I would like, possibly... We're going to start here for now. Um, I don't think there's much point in expanding a huge amount yet. Right, so how many stairs does this make us? Eight stairs, so we then want that. Let's not waste right now. Okay, and then let's do this, this. This, this. Grid power. You... Power RF, right? Yeah, you should do. Okay, so then we can... Let's make another bucket while we're thinking about this. And then we don't have to... We don't have to fill them up, I guess. We can just run over here real quick. Bang. Bang. And then run back. And then... Bang. Bang. And this is now getting charged. These are doing their thing. And we could just come back here again and just bang, bang. Oh, look at this. This is this is streamlined now. Dap, dap. Perfect. So, we have power now. So let's get rid of these things. And this is what we need to look into, which needs plastic, which needs dry rubber, which needs tiny dry rubber, which needs machine output from a latex processor. That's what we need. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Ooh, um, ooh. Ew, tin. Tin? Shit. <laughs> okay, so we do need to do some digging this episode. Uh, real quick digging. Don't know what that is. We ignore all those sorts of things. 
Uh, let's quickly chuck away some of these resources that we don't need right now. Um, sweep. Uh, sweep. Sweep. Sure, sweep. Uh, let's do that. That, 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 that. Uh, and then eat some of our french fries. Lovely. And then we just want to dig down, I guess, to a point where we're actually achieving stuff, right? So let's do this. Uh, put that there for a second. Because it's going to mean that our mine is a bit more... Oh, wait, no. That's wrong, isn't it? Uh, we need to dig always this block. Yes. Okay. We're in a maple woods. I just realized that. It says the biome. Uh, you can't really see the map and stuff because, again, my big old skull is blocking all of it. But we are in a maple woods. Um, oh, not anymore. We're in a land of lakes. For anyone that doesn't know, though, I really like maple trees. <laughs> I think they're a really beautiful tree. And I actually, I lived in Camden at one point. And I lived in a tiny little flat in the smallest room out of four of them shared with my friends. Uh, but there was a little balcony. I bought a maple tree and I grew it on my balcony for a good long while, to be fair, until I had to move and I didn't have um, I didn't have any any space anymore for for my little maple tree. It was very sad. I'm presuming we probably just go down to Y12 like um, like normal Minecraft because. This is an older version of Minecraft where we could probably find diamonds at Y12 as well. Uh, like 11, 12 sort of thing is usually what I used to dig down to. I'm presuming that's still the case. Um, so we're going to head for 12. Um, I'm, tr I'm not doing a lot of off-camera mining right now. I'm doing it all on camera. And I understand maybe this probably isn't that super interesting for people. If it's not, let me know and I'll maybe start doing some off-camera stuff and recapping for you guys but it's one of those where like the point of oh, okay the point of the hundred days is you guys kind of see it all um but if you don't want to see it all you don't want to see it all and we can we can try and do recap videos and stuff of what's gone on so that people can the people that want to see it maybe can i don't know i need i need feedback on this I need to know if you guys are enjoying, or if you're thinking, why is he showing us this? This is the most useless content around, and then I'll go, okay, and cry a little bit, but I'm a big boy, and I'll, uh, I'll grow up pretty quick. Uh, finding another lava lake also down here wouldn't be the worst. It would be a bit annoying if it's super far down, but at the same time, lava is lava. It's our only power source right now. Um, we could eventually move to a culinary generator, which is something I've never done. Um, but, oh, we're on 12 now. This is actually 11. So let's maybe, if we're going to do 3x3 three three digging, let's just dig like this and see if we find some tin, I guess. Uh, what we probably want to do, though, is go back up first. Um, because our hammer will die quite soon. Uh, again, iron hammer, low durability. Uh, so that's fine. I think it is quicker to replace the block, but I'm not sure. Uh, bang, bang. Do this real quick. Uh, but at least now we've got the mine sorted. We can at least now easily get down here for resources and all sorts of things. Um, which has been something that I needed anyway, because while being able to run round to that cave is probably quite useful, I think we're we're tapping its usefulness slowly to the point where the resources like the high end stuff, like diamonds and everything that we probably want, aren't really there anymore. Um, break these bits! Oh my god, it's just dirt. Give me stone. Oh, all of our tools actually could do with a little bit of a. Uh, a little bit of a healthy repair. Uh, tap, 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 tap. Okay, right. I think we're nearly at the top again. I need to do this because I was going to bang our heads constantly going up and down these goddamn stairs. Um, and at least now we'll have a good amount of space just to full sprint down 
uh, and full sprint back up. Because, I mean, while yes, it's annoying and it looks like it's taking time now, the amount of time saved, long run, I think will be better. Um, keep going. We're almost there. I think it's like another couple. I think the hammer will make it, durability-wise. Come on. We could also do with mining some obsidian at some point. There we go. I think that's right. Do that. There we go. Cool. So let's repair our stuff real quick. We can have a look at the battery to see how much has been generated currently. 400,000? So 100,000 per bucket. It's not bad. Um, right. Iron. Which we put over here, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. So then we come over here and we just quickly whack that in with that. Bang. Bang. Done. I think we leave the pick for now. And then we can literally, look at this, just throw ourselves down these stairs. Oh my god. Boy races outside. Uh, salt. So we're looking for tin. Uh, iron, though. We probably shouldn't pass up on it, considering how much we're using right now. Um, to keep our tools at least working. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Coal. Da -ba -ba -ba. Lapis is good. Tin. Tin was what we wanted, actually, wasn't it? So I think, technically, with ore doubling, that is enough tin for us. But it's always nice to just have a quick look and see if we can hunt any more. Um... We are comfortable with our iron pick again. Not sure what that's doing for us yet. Um, what is that? Ovium. Tinker's alloy. Okay. Uh, we'll, we'll leave it for now. No, we won't. I'll have it. We can't mine it. Okay. I won't have it. I chose that. That was my decision. Um, so we've got, I think, enough tin to make the gear. Um, but I don't know if we have enough tin to make the rest of the stuff that we need, so... We probably want to try and find a little bit more tin. Um, which means strip mining. Hup. Hup. Redstone. Hup. Give me tin. We could actually mine a load of redstone and try speed our hammer up, actually. Wouldn't be the worst idea. Ooh, untextured block again. Titanium ore. Oh, it's textured when it drops, though. Okay. Uh, nope. Quartz. Uh, we could do this and go a little branch this way. This is a very slow hammer. We might have to look into maybe going to the nether to try and get some uh, cobalt to speed it up, because that's a very fast uh, mining speed ore. Um, and it only gets faster as the durability goes down, as far as I'm aware. And I'm aware of a lot. Um, oh, no, nickel. Uh, but nickel we do need for Imbar, actually, to be able to upgrade our watering can. Come to think of it, uh, that will be enough, I think, actually, to upgrade our watering can. So that's pretty good. Um, but I think we're going to have to call the episode here with my whole let's try and do... Ah, silver. Let's try and do 20 minute episodes. Um, so let's go back upstairs. We'll have a look at what the day is. And then we'll come back next time for another episode of Insane Craft. I'm really enjoying this, to be fair. I think it's actually a really fun pack. While I think I've had my difficulties with it, it's still really good fun. Um... It still brings me a lot of a lot of joy playing it, actually, which is why the 40-minute episodes are so common. Or now I'm splitting them. Get out of my home! <laughs> is it because we haven't lit this place up or something? I have no idea. It's just in my house. Get out. Um, we'll open this little bag just to have a, a little bit of fun at the end. Ooh, a spawner seeker. And a broken shovel. That's useless, but that's useful. No spawners within 64 range. Okay, that's really cool. Okay, well anyway, as I said, let's have a look at the date. So, we are on day 13. And I think if we look outside, it's actually night time. Yes, it is night time. Um, so, probably going into day 14. 
we of course currently have some blood magic set up, some power generation and storage, um, explosions in the background and tinkers. So thank you very much for joining us this time and I will see you in the next one. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video, I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything. Go! Go wild!